Uh, well, I'm, I'm actually incredibly excited about the future of India. I think uh, India um, has more promise than any large country in the world. The, the takeaways yeah. from the meeting. Uh, uh, the takeaways from the meeting. Um, he really cares about India <laughs> because he's, he's pushing us to make significant investments uh, in India, which uh, it is something that we, that we intend to do. Um, and we're just trying to figure out the right timing. In a nutshell, um, it was a, a fantastic meeting with the Prime Minister, and um, uh, I, 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 I like him quite a lot. He visited our uh, Fremont factory several years ago, and so we've, we've now known each other for a while. So how do you see Prime Minister Modi's leadership role as far as making technology inclusive so that you know, digital infrastructure can be created? I, I can say he, um, he's, he's, he really wants to do the right thing for India. Uh, he wants to be open, he wants to be supportive of new companies, um, and obviously, but at the same time, make sure um, it accrues to India's advantage, which is, uh, you know, obviously, th that's the job. <laughs> I'm saying, he's, 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 um, I am a fan of Modi, so, <laughs> so I have what, to say that. What are your future plans, personally? What do you look at as far as investment in, in India is concerned? Yeah, um, well, I think there's, there's a tremendous amount of uh, potential uh, for all three pillars of the um, sustainable energy future. Uh, the, th the three pillars being uh, sustainable energy generation through solar and wind primarily. And obviously India is great for solar. Um, and um, the amount of land area you actually need to g generate enough uh, electricity to power India is, is very small. I, I believe it would be probably le 1 or 2% of the land area of India. So it's, it's very doable. Um, and then you need to pair that with... Uh, stationary battery packs uh, because the sun doesn't shine at night and then you need electric vehicles and then you have a sustainable energy future and I think it will uh, uh, the, the interesting thing people will find is that this is a lower cost way to go as well that may surprise people and, and we're also hopefully looking forward to bringing Starlink to India as well <laughs> so, you know uh, the Starlink internet yeah. uh, w which I think can be um, I incredibly helpful for um, sort of r remote or rural villages where they perhaps ha either may have no access to internet or the internet is very expensive and slow. Do you plan to visit India anytime soon? But like, did uh, Prime Minister extend an invitation to you? He, he did. Um, and uh, yes, I'm, I, I, I'm tentatively planning to visit India again uh, next year. I'm look at, looking forward to it.